How's it going guys? It's David and today is March 18th and it's Saturday. I haven't recorded for like three days, three or four days. It was a snowstorm. Uh, there was a huge snowstorm here, I think on Wednesday. I think it was Wednesday. But then, so I, I stayed home that day. And then uh, the next day I uh, came out and then we worked on uh, all the t-shirts here. So worked on uploading all of these and uh, sent out a bunch of eBay stuff. As well as the next day, we also worked on a bunch of eBay stuff, sent stuff out. I just didn't record any of that. And then yesterday, uh, I went uh, retail arbitraging to two Toys R Us's and spent about $1,000 or so. My sister came back from college for spring break, so she was with us. And then, uh, yeah, I'm out here today, today's Saturday. It's like, it's... 140 and I'm doing eBay stuff so I can ship out. There's a couple items. I just want to get it shipped out before uh, Before the weekend before they close cuz uh, I think somebody ordered on uh, early Friday So I don't want I do have a three-day policy, but I don't want it to extend on all the way to Monday So I'm getting that done right here. So it should be a pretty quick day uh, um, After this I'm gonna go back home um, And then work on eBay again trying to get all the stuff out but my Best Buy cards came in, so uh, I do have a credit line of a couple thousand more, which I can spend. And uh, I think by Tuesday, when Amazon come, the cash comes in, I should be able to cap all my other credit cards um, or pay it all back. So that's good there. Um, that should bring me back to a zero. So I'm just re-rotating it on this new credit card. So <laughs> it's the credit card rotation game, which is. <laughs> pretty pretty good um, it's going pretty well so um, and because it's although although Amazon uh, we are getting undercut by a lot on a lot of items I don't know what happened this week but uh, the sales did tank from last week cuz uh, I don't know everybody got on our listings and uh, they're under pressing by a couple cents and some couple dollars but uh, we are holding so it might be longer than a month of a flip maybe two months you have to estimate for Amazon uh, depending on the item, some some flips fast, but like uh, one item we went deep on the very first time we bought, uh, won't retail arbitraging. Um, that item finally started so, uh, selling at our price because we held. It was like cut by half uh, by Amazon, and then other people started dropping their <laughs> listings t in half to match Amazon's price or to be the first one to sell it all. But then it it, it hasn't actually been a month yet. It, it was like three weeks after. So we waited for three weeks and then now ours is starting to sell at the profitable price. So it's not the worst thing in the world. I mean, so if if you're uh, selling on Amazon, just uh, hold it out and then uh, the price will spike back up because it's uh, very, very, uh, it changes rapidly, constantly, and every day it changes. So um, you could keep up with it. You could be the first one to sell out if you want to be the first one to sell out, but uh, you, you know, you're going to take less of a profit. But if you do hold, eventually the price will skyrocket back up to you, depending on how many people there are and how fast the item moves. So, so if it's a fast I moving item, just just hold out a little bit, and then um, your listing will come up, and you will get the buy box. So that's that. Uh, and yeah, I think that's it for now. I gotta um, ship out all these stuff. Once again, I'm having a little trouble finding this one item within this small pile. Should be here somewhere, but it's taking up a lot of time. And the real crappy thing is, uh, I woke up, I think, yesterday and today morning, and my throat was just dying again. Um, it's not looking good. I was just on the edge of healing from my past sickness, and then I wake up, and then my throat hurts again. So hopefully this one isn't as bad, because last time... Um, that was bad like uh, for a week I couldn't do anything and then uh, for like three to f for almost a month I, uh, the cough was still there and like even on, up to last week like I wasn't fully healed from the coughing but now it's hurting again so uh, I don't know I gotta take it really easy um, it's unfortunate because like I'm, I'm watching other people and I'm learning new things and I want to expand quickly on, on this because um, um, yeah a lot of new things are popping up want to try it but you know with if my body can't keep up then I can't do it so 
you know, it's always that rush feeling of learning something new and then uh, trying to be part of that market as fast as I can before other people saturate it. Um, but, uh, you know, I think patience, patience really is key because uh, not only does that affect your mental health, but it, it affects uh, everything because rushing, thing, uh, rushing things too fast is never too good. Um, and I know what I'm seeing right now is just uh, just the all the pros that I'm seeing because nobody shows the cons and everything. So you know you got to take it for what it is and just take your time with things and just keep moving forward. Even at my rate, I think I'm still going at a pretty good rate because uh, three months ago I didn't even know about Amazon and like I've been at the game for like a month maybe like really going in from like the really big. Uh, um, the really big boxes that I sent in to FBA so it's only been like a month or so and before that I was just doing eBay uh, I was doing you know I was getting pallets off of like bulk and like um, other liquidation sites and um, doing that and prior to that I was at home um, doing yard sales and stuff so it's only been a couple months and I've heard he came here but I still see other things that I couldn't take steps to do so but uh, it's just you know, got to take your time and watch the health, I guess. And with that being said, I know my YouTube uploads are pretty random right now. It's just, uh, it's not constant at least. But I'm doing the best I can because uh, there's a lot of things that I'm trying to do and my head's going this way and that way. But to, uh, you know, record that every day and edit it and then put it up, it's very difficult. So. You know, sometimes it's gonna be after three days, sometimes I'm not gonna record at all, but um, I'm gonna do my best trying to document the steps so that uh, when I look back at this, um, I get a clear cut um, picture of how, you know, the, the exact steps that I took to get to where I will be in, I don't know, three years, maybe once I'm hopefully able to achieve that goal of uh, clearing my debt. And w once that's done, I wanna be able to look back and see the entire steps. So. I will be recording it, but, you know, as far as entertainment value, I don't know how entertaining it is, but it's just documenting stuff, so, um, I mean, yeah, for, for me, at least personally, it's going to be fun to watch, you know, in the future, but I don't know about you guys that are finding me through um, just keyword searches. I'm, I don't even share this with anybody, but uh, I know a lot of people, like, most, pretty much all of my subscribers subscribe uh, because all of you guys uh, subscribe because... Um, I guess you found me through the keyword searches and stuff. So, um, you know, I will try to, I'll try to keep it somewhat entertaining, but you know, I no guarantees. So at worst, hopefully you learn something out of it and uh, gain something and, you know, start something of your own and maybe you can get out of a situation like me too.